Good Wednesday morning, everybody. Chris Allen with your weather podcast for this January 25th. Today will be the last of the warm days for quite a while. So I hope that you enjoy it. The winds are already beginning to pick up from the south and southeast. We'll see breezy conditions today, 20 to 30 mile per hour winds, warm winds, which should uh, shoot us all the way up into the upper 50s, maybe even the low 60s, before the temperatures come crashing down and we hit the reset button for the rest of this week and into the weekend, even the beginning of next week. And for those of you who are looking for snow chances, you may get a little. Notice I said a little. People, some of them only heard the word snow. They didn't hear me say the word little. (laughs) That's the way it goes. You hear what you want to hear. You see what you want to see. Well, let's get to it here. The numbers from yesterday, a high of 50 in Bowling Green. That happened around 430 yesterday as we finally got some sun working in here. Uh, 50 degrees is 5 degrees above the average high of 45. 35 was our low, 9 degrees warmer than the average of 26. One year ago was snow on the ground, if you'll recall. That's, uh, you know, a year ago, yesterday, day before, actually, uh, is when we had that uh, foot and a half of snow on the ground. Yeah, it was a year ago. So the ground uh, was pretty cold. The air was pretty cold. We had a high of 32 and a low of (laughs) 2. Just 2. One year ago, yesterday, back in 2016. No precipitation here past 24 hours. Holding at 4.16 for the month of January. That's a surplus of 1.41. Today, we're going to find showers returning. We've got a fast-moving cold front that will be in here later today. Out ahead of it, there will be a stripe of showers. Uh, Don't think it's going to be a lot of rain, but just enough. As it passes through, you'll know, you know, it's raining. Warm front at first. That's going to warm us up to 63 today with a southwest wind breezy, 15 to 20 with occasional gusts to 30. 40 percent coverage of showers as we get into the day tonight a leftover 20 percent chance of showers breezy uh continuing the breezes are going to continue even through the night as that cold front passes we'll see a low of 37 and the winds will become more westerly as we get into tonight and early thursday thursday it's going to be a partly sunny chilly and breezy day The high, only 42, and this is the beginning of the run of colder air that is going to be with us through the rest of the week and into the upcoming weekend. We're going to get down to 29 for a low temperature Thursday night. Friday, another little clipper system will move through very weak as it comes in, mainly light rain, about a 20% chance with a high of 41 and still breezy too. But it, uh, as you know, we get down to 25, any leftover moisture from rain would change over to some light flurries, maybe. Not a big deal. Uh, Saturday, we're going to see a mostly sunny day, but it's only going to get up to 44 with a west wind still breezy at 13. And then as we get into Sunday, that's the system to watch. It has a little more potency with it. A little more moisture. We're calling for a 30% chance of some light rain that could change over to light snow by Sunday evening. After a high of 40, we'll get down to 25. So certainly cold enough for snow. But the thing that I'm not really um, hooked into or feeling that confident about is uh, we we haven't really had a lot of cold air established before that system arrives. I mean, yeah, we'll get down to 30 Saturday night, but then we'll warm back to 40 during the day on Sunday, and then that system comes through pretty quickly. It's really not going to have a, a lot of time to put down a lot of precipitation, 
and I think most of it will start as rain and not just be snow. But um, as we get down to 25 for an overnight low Sunday night, then certainly whatever falls could freeze on the roadways and cause an issue there, maybe uh, late Sunday night into Monday morning. So we'll just have to wait and see. But if you're looking for accumulating snow, this would be one of those that just comes in and does a light coating, maybe less than an inch in some cases. It's just not going to be that big of a deal. Monday will be another chilly day, mostly sunny and 42. But then Tuesday of next week, we do see a warming just before the next clipper system arrives on Wednesday. We'll get up to 52. All right, that's that's it, pretty much. I mean, like I said, there's a chance that somebody could get some snow flurries or light snow showers out of these uh, series of clipper systems that's going to come in the next few days. But if you're looking for big snow, you know, the kind that, like last year, nah, it's not that. None of it. Not even close. All right, that will do it for this edition of the podcast. God bless as always, and thank you so much for listening. Know the weather before it knows you. Have a great day. I'll see you live at 5.30 on AM Kentucky, 11 AM on midday, streaming live to the WBKO app and WBKO.com. Later today, if you can, join me for my radio show at Classic Hits, Sam 100.7, between 3 and 7 p.m.